Department of Western Aid arrives in Moscow as Mikhail and Raisa Gorbachev give their first American interview since the resignation. This is NBC Nightly News with Tom Brokaw reporting tonight from Moscow with Jane Pauley in New York. Good evening from Moscow, where today Western cargo planes loaded with Western aid arrived in this economically beleaguered nation. And as the planes arrived, Mikhail Gorbachev told NBC News that economic reforms here are struggling because the new Commonwealth of Republics still is too divided. In Germany... As the Iron Curtain comes crashing down around what used to be the Soviet Union, the citizens of this country are getting a taste of something new, American pop culture. Movies, radio, music, advertising, and of course, junk food. But where does that leave the Russian culture? NBC's Veronica Kilchovskaya. The, the point isn't to advertise. Craig Cochran is a Moscow representative for America's most and famous export, Coca-Cola. How does he see his role in bringing part of American culture to Russia? I think there's two ways to approach this country. One is to be a pirate and come in here and try to pillage the land. And the other is to be a pioneer. And I'd like to consider myself in the, in the second category. So how can Americans bring their culture here and not destroy what Russians are proud of? I think uh, what you need to do is come to Russia, understand it, and only develop a genuine mutual blending of the cultures. Not to just impose American culture. That's, that's not what we do. Craig thinks like many Russians. We welcome American culture, but only if it enriches rather than replaces what we value already. Veronika Kuchevskaya, NBC News, Moscow. That's nightly news for this Monday night from Moscow. I'm Tom Brokaw. I'll see you from New York tomorrow night with part two of the Gorbachev interview. His thoughts on Saddam Hussein, Fidel Castro, and who won the Cold War. I'll see you then.